For decades, Hinkley Yachts has been synonymous with innovative technologies. It's a company that brought us the joystick, jet drives, the picnic boat. In recent years, they had the electric dasher. So when I got a call last week from the Vice President of Sales and Marketing, Scott Bryant, saying that they were working on something, it was completely secret, he couldn't tell me what it is, but he invited me up to come check it out, well, he certainly had my attention. You know, that doesn't mean it didn't stop my mind from wandering these last few days. Could this be something to do with future electrification, uh, diesel outboards perhaps? Is it something to do with autonomous technology? There's sea machines in Boston that's been doing a lot of things that are on the cutting edge of that front. Uh, then I got really excited. Maybe it's hydrogen. Maybe it's foils. Hinkley submarine? My mind went crazy. We had no idea what to expect here today. So we're glad to have you on the journey with us. Let's go uh, peel back the curtain on this one. Hey, Dan. Hey, what's going right on, in? Scott? Good to see you. Yeah, good to see you. Welcome. Thanks for, uh, thanks for having us for the, the big unveil. Absolutely. Well, um, all I can say is this is going to be a memorable Hinkley experience. One for Okay. Books. I like the sound of that. Um, so I'm excited to kind of get into, uh, get into what we have today. Well, the, the suspense is building. Where, do we, where do we start? Scott went on to explain that the company teamed up with transmission experts TwinDisc to collaborate on a hybrid electric system called SilentJet that would switch seamlessly and automatically from diesel to electric power depending on how much throttle you're using. He also gave us a first look at a video that shows how the system can be charged off the running diesel engines as well as shore power. It also eliminates the need for a generator when spending time out on the hook. He claimed that the system would offer the best of both worlds, high performance diesel power when you're ready to go fast and far, and silent electric steering when taking your guests on a sunset cruise. We headed down to the dock to see the system in action and see for ourselves just how seamless it really was. Great. All right, well, let's, uh, let's go have a Hinkley experience on uh, silent jet. Let's All right, it. you have to twist my arm. Let's do it. All right. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to turn... I'm just gonna actually light up the diesel engine and just so you guys can, hear so you can hear it, okay? Smart. And I'm gonna engage it with the jet so you can see, okay, this is what a de is an older diesel jet boat feels like yeah. with a diesel engine running, okay? So, here we go. Diesel engine, we've got, you know. What is the diesel power? This is, uh, for this, this, um, this boat, this demo boat, it's an FPT 570. That's not original. No. That's it's new. This is it's a new this diesel. Is new. Okay. Yeah, it's a new modern diesel. So, you know, here we are. This is like regular jet boat. You can see the wash going out, you know, the side, which is the standard for a jet boat kind of a thing. Yeah. You know, we've got, I've got control here at the dock. You know, the whole thing, just like the regular jet boat, I can twist, right. move the boat around, whatever I got to do, the whole thing, right? right. So you kind of get used to what this sound is like. It's, it's, this, it's the sound we know and love, right? Yep. So, um, you know, if I, what, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put it into just automatic mode, which is what most people are going to run the boat in, in automatic, right? And that what, what will happen is it'll, the software will say, okay, I'm in automatic mode and I don't need the diesel engine right now and I'm just going to slowly, I'm going to take it through its shutdown cycle and I'm just going to let the electric motor take over. It's based on, it's supposed to be based on RPM, right? So you're, you're at a low yes. enough RPM or yep. RPM and measures RPM yeah. and speed. Yes. I will also mention, I'll mention this now actually, while we're sitting here yeah. at, with this idle situation, we are putting, you can look right here, we're putting 23 kilowatts into the batteries right now. Okay? That's a, that's a pretty amazing number. Yeah, okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into automatic and you're going to, what's going to happen is I said Shut the down. software will be like, oh, I'm in automatic mode. I don't need a diesel engine. Yeah. So, and it, what it does, it takes, it's a cycle that it goes through. So I'm going to go over, I'm going to put it in automatic. It takes a minute to kind of, it's like, okay, if you felt that turn off, it slows down. Now like throw some diesel onto the turbo to make sure it stays clean. And here we are, we're in hybrid mode. We're ready to go boating. Pretty amazing. Let's go. Pretty amazing.
go boating long enough, you know that feeling when you slow the boat down and the engine stole out from under you. It's kind of a sickening feeling. I have a little bit of a knot in my stomach just thinking about it right now. But on the Hinkley Dasher with the silent jet system, that's all part of the plan. The boat seamlessly transitions from diesel to electric mode. And all I can hear right now is the sound of the water going past the hull, very much in the same vein as a sailboat. Perhaps the one thing I like about sailing. The peacefulness, it really can't be put into words. It's something you really need to experience to truly understand. And the best part about this is it's the best of both worlds. Right now we're cruising peacefully in the bay, but you want to get home, life's too short for six or seven knots. Well, you have that option too. Sometimes boats or technology change the game with big, loud, boisterous announcements. I think of boats like the HCB 65 or the Mercury 600, the carbon fiber Jarrett Bay, or even a foiling princess yacht. Others are a little more subtle and sometimes met with skepticism. I think of things like the original torpedo outboard or even diesel outboards. I think of systems like the Sea Keeper or Zip Wake. The silent jet system from Hinkley will likely fall in that latter category, but based on driving around Dasher around the bay today, I have a feeling that this is gonna be the biggest innovation in boating that you never heard coming.